Food is a provision, which means it has to have a source. It has to come from something, somewhere. I believe that we've brought ourselves to this point in our society where we are so far disconnected from our food that we truly have very little concept of what food is. When 7K Panorama Ranch and I connected to discuss featuring their grass-fed and ethically raised beef, I saw the opportunity to share these sentiments and spread the word of eating as close to the source as possible. Here we created a beautiful spread focused around ingredients raised and grown on the ranch. Starting with these incredible strip loins from 7K Angus Beef, We reverse seared them and finished them off by simply butter basting them in garlic grown here on the ranch with some fresh thyme. Huge. So perfect and finished off with a generous sprinkle of Malden salt. And since we got our first real snowfall of the season last night and it's a bit chilly out, I thought it would be a great idea to make a warm, creamy, buttery polenta that is cooked in a rich broth of herbs and garlic. Wow. Last, but certainly not least, I needed to find a way to showcase the beets that are grown here on the ranch. I decided a warm, beef panzanella salad would be the perfect touch. Panzanella is traditionally a rustic salad made from day-old bread with spring and summer vegetables. We'll get a little bit of a drier beef because uh, the steam will, if the steam stays inside, it'll become watery. And then when I make the salad, you'll just get beet water. I decided it would be nice with a little twist. Roasted beets tossed with lightly pickled red onions, rye bread croutons, fresh grapefruit, shaved Asiago cheese, and an array of fresh herbs. This was the perfect touch to round off this entire meal. The acidity from the pickled onions and grapefruit to cut the richness of the steak and polenta made for a truly exceptional experience for the taste buds and bellies. <laughs> After our meal, I head out for a walk around the ranch, taking in the sights and touring facilities. I am filled with an almost unexplainable gratitude. It's a type of joy that tells me how little I really need in my life to find so much satisfaction. For as long as I can remember, I've had this out of the ordinary attraction to food. Everything about food interests me. The way it looks, its enticing aromas, the nourishment and comfort it provides, and among many other things, nothing about it has resonated more clearly with me than where it comes from. I encourage you all to explore the food sources around you, whether it be by growing your own zucchini, catching trout in the babbling brook behind a cabin, and of course getting to know and supporting your local farmers, ranchers, and producers closest to home. Thank you, 7K, for letting me build a connection to your land.